just wanted to um, show you guys. This is where I put the my purse, and I'm loving it. I should have done this years ago. I need to change my lens, which is why it has that um, glare in there. Ordered it through Amazon, but I I'm using this purse today. I love crossbodies, and I I like this one to where I don't have to be careful. So I, that's why I like the Gucci canvas because it's already pre-treated. But the reason that I love my pouches is because it's easy for me to be able to just kind of like take things out and I've got my keys and these are receipts from Ikea and this actually you no know, oh that's my boarding pass from Hawaii um and then oh Danica I found your phone and then my my name tag because I gotta go to work today and that's it. See, everything else is out. And then I got my two coins in here. My mom taught me to always have at least a little bit of money, even though it's a penny, into your purse because it's good luck. But this is how easily I change out my, my purse. So now the inside of this, which is this, I'm going to put in here. Easy peasy. All right, friends. Um, I went to work for a little bit in real estate. I went to the office and I dropped off hubby and Uncle Brian to the airport. Uh, today is Thursday. They're going back to the condo to paint and buy a sofa. And then on the way home, I'm driving the truck because they brought two boxes and a fishing pole. I said fishing pole, but it's actually um, a rod that I bought here. But um, I mapped to go home. And then it was like, at first it took me the right direction to the 405. Right? And then it told me to exit. And I'm like, I don't think this is the way home. And so sure enough, it's my same address, but different city. So <laughs> as I'm driving, I'm changing the GPS carefully. And then I had to exit the first exit that it told me and it happened to be Ikea. So here I am, just meant to be. A couple more stuff, purchase. And I got these, cause again, space for the ceiling. So utilizing that space, this is $10 two of those so I can put this this was I think six dollars to go in there so, look at that onto the ceiling and then I like this and to be in that pot and then I like these there's two of them to kind of put on a, a peg peg hook two of those and we just need a silver like drill. It's 14. And then um, a pot. And this one I figured I'd use that. And this is a cable. Um, cable wire to, to hide it. Um, and we are at plants. I don't want to buy too much stuff because last time we were here, I spent 800 friends, which is not good. But um, there's this one thing that I wanted that they did not have was was the the shoe to put the to hide the shoes. So I'm gonna look for that. Also some, a little bit of greenery, but I don't want like the, I don't want that desert one. So I don't want too much of a succulent, but I don't like flowers. Mm. Ooh, like these ones are cute. Like these, $14 for these. That, I like that. It looks nice and real. I showed you guys how I changed my purse of the day, so it's so easy when I have things in pouches. I can easily just change it in about less than three minutes kind of thing. Yeah. Like that. And so the thing, um, I have a honey finish of the, so I want it to be white. Um, white furniture, things from Ikea that's white, like this. But also um, honey, like a, this color because that's what the TV stand is and 
I just think that this is too small of a pot for it. Or maybe not. Like that. Hmm. How's that, friends? How much is that? Ten dollars for that. Okay, this is what I was looking at for the these. These are ten dollars. But then that's what they have up there. This is a sample of what they have, and I do like this one as well. This one. Really like that one. So I'm gonna look for this plant and it's nice, the wax, nice and thick. We currently have this in our um, kitchen patio, but the nice thing about this is that it's, it folds so you can store it for the winter. And it's only 29 and 25 so really affordable, but two for our lanai. Lanai is basically like a, a patio um, for the outside. So I asked hubby if we can um take that and then um these i got all these plants these will be in a box so he went there with two boxes we get two um we get free check bags up to 50 pounds so we got the um we're utilizing that and then just um checking in just boxes and we brought clothes last time all right friends i'm gonna go ahead and drive home this is it this is all i'm getting from ikea this time around i'm pretty proud of myself although i will be back here again sunday to pick them up because today's thursday they'll be there until sunday sunday morning coming back sunday evening oh, let's see this one i don't like the oh, the bamboo's okay but i don't like the it's a little bit fakey not know that ikea had all these little breakfast like jams or just jams in particular the fruit spread so bilberry i don't know what that is i don't know what a bilberry is looks like a blackberry or a blueberry but lingonberry they always have this this is an orange and elderflower marmalade this is a raspberry and bilberry spread strawberry spread and they're all organic not cool and they are how much like five dollars five forty nine $4.99, $5.79. Oh. I'm gonna buy this for the kids. And um, that's about it, I think. That's all I'm gonna get. Jonathan likes the chocolate ones and Danny, Danica, but they don't have any. I'll pay for this. I spent $1.79 of all these. Oh, friends, it adds up. Oh, I can pay for it here also i keep seeing these cute things i have this one it's so like i love it it's so cute i think i'm gonna bring it to the condo because um i don't really use it here for entertainment uh entertaining but look at these um ketchup and mustard from ikea isn't that cool oh cute all right so cute
at Koolina Beach. This is Lagoon 4. Can't beat it. Sand is way too hot. Let's put my beach towel down. And here we are, Koolina Beach. Here we are at Koolina Beach. This is Lagoon 4. Can't beat it. Sand is way too hot. Let's put my beach towel down. And here we are, Koolina Beach. Lola if she wanted to go to um, Hawaii with us because we're bringing Jonathan for his birthday and leaving uh, big girls. the big girls along with Uncle Brian um, the house and and so Lola said she might <laughs> well, hopefully she will and she wanted to for her birthday she wanted to go to a Korean is it Korean hot soup? she said Korean hot soup and hot soup and then I just got off work um, and I showered and then gonna go see her and then I gotta go uh, back to work for a, a couple of hours of floor duty and I wanted to go ahead and uh, and do that today so busy 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 all right friends let me zoom out so this is going to be our third trip to Hawaii and we've already packed I think there's already four boxes of these Home Depot boxes there. So each time we go, we just bring a few more boxes. And to be honest, I'm not really, aside from the Ikea that you saw uh, the other day of uh, purchasing, I'm not really purchasing anything else. Oh, I have this open for the light. Um, because I have enough stuff here to actually... Um, decorate both houses so like Alexa we have one in every room and they're like the older models but it's okay we just need it for sleep um, sleep music or basic stuff we don't need the upgraded version bringing these camping stuff so before we bought the condo we would go over there and just um, like get a um, get a spot at the when hubby and I would just go We'd actually just go camping, like just rent a car that accommodates us. And then we would uh, rent a spot over at the um, military base, a uh, bellows. And then the, like it would be a camping spot here with the car. And th this is why I have the door open as well to show you guys. And then the pole right there, which is not far at all, is the beach coming, the waves coming in. So we used to enjoy doing that. And... These are like blow up ones from Costco. You just blow it up and then you put it on the, like the, the back of the car, like you fold the seat over, so. But I'm still gonna bring it, so we're still gonna enjoy um, camping by the beach because we really like waking up in the morning and then just going swimming and it's a private beach, military, it's, no one's there. Hi bear, come here. Oh my gosh, friends. Oh, here is my new, 
um, outfit that I purchased uh, yesterday. Um, and then this one from, I love these. These are the ones that I've been really wearing during the summer. And it's just a wrap, I think it's what you call it. But um, you can use it for the beach, like a bathing suit. But I use it for shorts and like a tank top when it's hot because it's so flowy. These are the stuff that we're bringing. Hubby likes this from Costco. It was like $9, I think it was. It was on clearance. But it's a portable thing, table. So when we go to the beach, I might, um, I'm just going to take that out of the box. So I'm basically bringing stuff from our house. <laughs> like these stuff i have these from ikea and then this one is really nice because it's a before we bought the portable ac unit at, in every room go outside there come here say sorry to mommy say sorry she knows how to say sorry say sorry come on yeah you're a good bear good bear and then um these are these are shelves that i showed you guys on like uh, my ikea video I got two of those. This was just donation, these three. This is to hide the cord. This is nice um, to hold stuff, like especially in the bathroom and such, and then easily to carry out. And then I have Sensi soaps, but I really like this one from Trader Joe's, so I bought a few of those, and then I'm just going to bring that over. But these are really nice from Ikea. I really like those. This is from the house. Just bringing that over. Like I said, filling up the box because we get each time we travel, we get two free um, check in bags. So we don't really we just bring a carry on for our um, for our clothes because we already have clothes there. So we utilize the purchasing here because it's so hard to purchase there. And then just usually utilizing the stuff that I have around the house that I don't really need. So. Yeah, let me just turn down the fan. I'm doing a quick lunch for the family and basically whatever veggies I have. Um, I have uh, green beans, um, like the long beans, long green beans. And then from the garden, I have zu uh, zucchini and then green onions also from the garden. And then just regular onions. And then I have bok choy that I, I bought from Trader Joe's. And then... And then I do like to use this tofu from uh, Costco because when it's so affordable, like a pack of four for $6, I wash it and then uh, drain it and then kind of squeeze all the liquid out. <coughs> then I'm going to, I'm going to cook it separately. Oh my gosh, Bear, leave him alone. So Bear is, I think seven months now. Java is 12 years old. <laughs> Come here. Come here, Bear. Say sorry. Come on. Say sorry. Come here. Say sorry to Java. Mm. Come on. Oh, bless you, Java. All right. So, again, I'm going through the house of what I can pack. And these are, like, multiple things that I have here. I have a, um, a Vitamix. So, I don't really need this small one. And, I, and the condo is so small. So, I'm just going to pack this. Bring it. One of these. I have multiple of these. Um, this one bring there, this one as well. So one tin, um, two of these, and then like a cookie thing. Cause these, all these like add up when you, when you have to buy them and I don't need to purchase it if I can bring boxes. There. And then for the tofu, I just put uh, garlic powder and then pepper only Danica, I mean not Danica, Danny and I and Danielle eats tofu. None of the other kids in the house eats tofu. A little bit of um, to flavor. This is from Trader Joe's. This gives it a little kick. Okay, and then a little bit of um, aloha soy sauce just to flavor and then salt and pepper. And then sometimes what I'll do too is uh, instead of ground beef, I'll um, I'll crumble the tofu. Um, I've been eating a lot more tofu than actual meat, um, like chicken. I don't care much for chicken, but I will cook chicken for you know the kids. 
and then um, and pork. Um, pork, I only like it with uh, certain dishes like uh, sinigang, Filipino sinigang, which is the sour soup. And then also like Filipino barbecue. But other than that, I don't care much for it. Um, I do like tofu. The other tofu I like, okay. this is also the other tofu I like. I get this at H Mart, Korean um, Asian market. And it's the tofu puff. So it's, um, it's airy on the inside, very light. I just saute this with a little bit of just um, chili uh, sesame oil as well and then a little bit of soy sauce, uh, photocopy, salt, pepper, garlic and it's so so good. Alright I also like to get these ginger and garlic from Trader Joe's. Um, as you guys can tell I use it a lot. It's so convenient to just pop one of these out into my dishes. Um, sometimes my fresh garlic does go bad and so this way when I buy these um, it's easily accessible and then I don't have to prep up those fresh garlics and it really just tastes the same as fresh one. Okay. As you guys can see easily if it comes out and pop them in there. And then the secret to the secret to having tofu not as light in color and a bit darker so it, it looks more like meat is what I use is a uh, premium like dark soy sauce. So as you guys can see, I just put a little dash and look how dark it's gotten. Okay, I decided not to add the bok choy. There's plenty of uh, veggies. So put that in there. Put a little bit of water. There's a little bit of water. Add that in there. Kind of steams the the veggies and then that's it friends okay. nice lunch for me and the girls all right friends and that is it that's my lunch that simple easy and then i just used up whatever uh, leftover veggies i had in the fridge and then from the garden so very simple and easy to make friends all right lunch we got done eating lunch we are going to the waterfront with bear <laughs> and um jonathan forgot our parking Yay! Yay! so we get free parking oh, hi bear Boy. first um, time at the waterfront with bear no she's gone before when she was a puppy we just haven't gone in a few weeks because we've been so busy so, all right, getting fish and chips. Um, walk to the waterfront. There's Jonathan. Come here, bear. Oh, oh my God, it's such a good day. Come here. You want me to hold her so you can um eat your ice cream? Um, no. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Oops, sorry, bear. Look at that. It's a fairy, as you guys can see. I miss my um the ring for the camera. Um, this used to be the ferry terminal right here, like where we're at. And then they moved it way over there. Come on, bear. Nope. Come on. Bear, let's go. Bear, come on. I need to get her a new, like, collar or all these i just found these they were from like dice so i think it was come on there let's go this way too big i think <laughs> but it's making do leash and scoop come on bear this way Mm -hmm. You can be a sport. 
Why don't you put that one down and hold bear? Danica? Bear loves the water.